Hi guys, it's Lindsay. So, I'm coming to you today with a what's in my book bag video. I recently just purchased this book bag off of eBay for $15. And um, I think after shipping it came out to $24. Which is a really, really great deal on a Vera Bradley book bag. Especially something that m is maybe a year old or so. And there was only one thing wrong with it, so I'll turn it around. And if you look right here, there was a tear right here in the fabric. And then there was a rip right here in the nylon strap. So me and my mom went to the craft store and we found this stuff, Instant Vinyl Transparent Adhesive. And it worked really, really well. I think this was like $7.99, but we had a coupon to get it half off and um so i definitely recommend this and then we're going to go back sorry this is my new cat willow willow look my new cat willow um we're going to take some bias tape and go around it and sew it in so that's hidden and it's more secure but it's very uh very well bonded together now so anyways, I'll turn this back around and I'll just take you through what I have. I don't go to school physically. I take online classes, which I should be done this December. So I'm very excited about that. Um, but I take this to work so I can work on my school stuff and um, also carry my work stuff in there as well. So I'll start with the outside of the bag first. And as you can see, I have a Bath & Body Works hand sanitizer, and I have it in Orchard Frost, which is very nice. I really like that scent, and I love this little holder. It's so sparkly. Um, I have a poofy keychain that I got from Dollar Tree, which matches the bag very, very well. So I thought I would add a little bit of, you know, something to the bag. So... We go ahead and go into the front zipper right here, and I have several things in here. So I have my dry shampoo. I have a full-size bottle of poopery, which I haven't tried this yet, but um, I thought I would just carry it with me. So if I decide to, I have it. I have my thing of sunblock. It's like a, it's almost like a balm. You just like rub it on. I have an extra thing of chapstick because I keep some in my purse. And then I have a mini size bottle of lotion from Bath and Body Works. Winter Candy Apple is my favorite winter scent that they have. And that's all that's in that pocket, but it definitely fits a lot more. And before I get into this, I do want to show that it does have two of these elastic um, pockets on the side. So if it's a rainy day, I'll put my umbrella in there or um, I'll put a bottle of water or something in there. Now for the medium pocket have a lot in here as well I have a full-size bottle of body spray from Bath and Body Works this is the older scent I got this during their uh, semi-annual sale a couple years ago actually so I still have that I have my extra glasses that I bought from firm you uh, I definitely recommend that uh, online service it's a lot cheaper than even going to Walmart Vision Center um, and they usually have sales going on, so that I would recommend that. I have a full size thing of feminine cleansing cloths. I got this from Dollar Tree. I love Summer Eve's, Summer's Eve uh, version, so I wanted to try Dollar Tree's version to see how that worked. I have a little mirror. I have a telescoping back scratcher see if I can get it. Ah, uh, there we go. Telescoping back scratcher. I got this from Walmart during their Christmas uh, season where they sell a bunch of, you know, weird gifts 
that they don't have year-round. And that's it that's inside this compartment. Again, more stuff could fit. There's four pen slots. I only have two in use right now. I got all these pens from Dollar Tree. Those two came together. I have my pepper spray. And then I have this whole set of colored pens with colored ink that I got from Dollar Tree that I have for quick access. And then in this back slip pocket, I have a whole thing of hair ties. And then in this pocket, I have a little bitty notebook for if I need to grab it quickly for a meeting or whatever it's at a work. Okay, now to go into the main compartment. I'm going to unzip it. And I have a lot in here. So as you can see, I have this cosmetic case which I carry my everyday uh, makeup in this is in rumba and this came in the uh, travel cosmetic set that I got last year um, that had the big clear uh, the big clear bag and a smaller cosmetic bag this bag and a brush bag so in here like I said I have my everyday makeup and um, anything that I could possibly want to do if I need to change something up or sometimes I'll even go to work and not have my makeup done and then I'll just do it um, at some point during that time at work. So I'll just kind of give you a brief overlook of what I have in here. Uh, this is Rimmel London Transparent Powder. Uh, this is Maybelline Fit Me Press Powder. This is Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. Uh, Precision's Formula Mascara. This is a lip gloss I got in a subscription um, thing that I don't do anymore, but I really like this color. It's a really pretty coral color. This is a Tarte eyeshadow palette for green eyes. I use this a lot. This is a Tarte palette that came in a whole bigger set called uh, away we go or something and I use this blush mostly plus the eyeshadows so very cute you can tell it's really dirty I've had it for a while I have a essence brow gel I love essence you can get that at Ulta and it's really really cheap like I think I paid three dollars for this and most of their stuff ranges from a dollar to three dollars this is another essence item this is a liquid eyeshadow it's a it's like a purpley pink color my Rimmel London my Rimmel London primer if I could talk I have a Ulta Beauty lip infuser lip oil or juice infused lip oil I'm sorry and this is coconut that I got in a free Ulta Beauty bag Ulta lipstick in pink chocolate. Very pretty color. Very, very nice neutral. I've got my Lash uh, Paradise from L'Oreal mascara. A lip liner from Ulta. A lip liner from Rimmel London that I use quite often. And a NYX uh, Super Clicky lipstick really love this color this is in the color OBS OBVS I have a full-size eyeshadow palette from NYX that I got for my birthday last year that I haven't really used yet but um, you see the colors really nice <clears throat> I have my shimmer bronzers right here that I use for highlighting my brightener from Maybelline do that last. My foundation from Maybelline. My BB cream from Rimmel London. A pencil sharpener for my uh, lip liners. <clears throat> oh, I thought I had an eyeliner in here. Maybe I don't. I need to find that. And this is my uh, travel brush set that I have. So it comes with four uh, mini brushes 
for any kind of eye look that you might need. And then this is a like eyebrow, there's hair on there, eyebrow brush. And then I have my eyeshadow primer from Urban Decay. And then I have a little, uh, a set of extra earrings that I carry with me. Just so I always have, you know, that option. So that's what I have in there. Then back to the book bag. I have my pencil case that I have from Vera Bradley. Um, this is in Hello Dahlia. And in here I have all of my really nice pens that I use for journaling and drawing or whatnot. And it's got the Stadler pens, the Macron pens, and I've also got those really nice highlighters that don't bleed. I don't remember the brand. Let's see if I can twist it. Mild liner. I really like those. Those are really great for highlighting in books. So you, you don't have to worry about it bleeding. I also have like the full size razor. I mean razor really. Eraser. <laughs> and um, so this is like all of my nice pens that I wouldn't necessarily use for work. So that's why I have those other pens in here to get to if I need a pen for work. Then I have a little post-it set that I use for work a lot or if I need to make notes in a book that I'm reading or whatnot. Then this is in Lola and I've already used some of the flags up as you can tell. I have a poetry book in here that my friend wrote and I'm going through it right now. Stop going through it right now and writing down notes um, as you can see right there and I've highlighted right there so I'm going through that right now and I'm enjoying it definitely recommend I have this spiral notebook that I use for both work and school um, and it has three compartments I got this from Office Depot it has three compartments the first compartment or section is lined like a notebook the sec the second one is um, grid paper and the last section is blank paper so I use it for both work and school then I have my planner which I got this from Walmart um, just a standard agenda there's nothing really that special about it um, it has pockets right here a little flap right there and um, I'll show you this month this is kind of what I got going on right now and then next month we have some events going on where I work so just to kind of give you a look at that and then there's a notepad at the back so uh, if I have to go somewhere for a meeting like off the property I will take this with me for notes and to write into my agenda then I have three spiral notebooks that I got from Walmart um, that I use for school or whatnot and this is the one I'm currently using for my class that I take taking right now called wellness so I got that I have a empty folder for any papers that I need to take to or from work so it doesn't get bent so I have that I don't have any papers in there right now but I know I will because uh, my school I'm gonna have to start doing some research and print all that stuff out so okay then there's these two mesh pockets in the back quit sorry my cat is like wanting to play right now and here I have my um, earbuds that um, I got this case from Atlantis um, Resort in the Bahamas. Look at that. She's getting all comfy in there. If only she knew that she's not going to stay. Um, so I carry these with me. And then I have a thing of post-its that are Vera Bradley as well. This is Frankly Scarlet. It's an older pattern. Haven't used it yet, but um, I figured I would have it to just to be proactive and to start using the stuff that I buy 
And then right here, I have a card set that I bought from, uh, I think, Home Goods or somewhere. And it just has two decks of cards and a set of dice. Where I work, I work at a museum, so a lot of the times it's really, really, really slow. And I have a coworker that works with me, and we work in the gift shop area. So sometimes it gets very, very slow, boring, and there's nothing to do. So I like to carry stuff with me um, to do things. Then there's a back zip. Ow! Willow, quit. There's a back zip pocket for your laptop so I have that option of taking that taking my computer if I need to I don't think I will need to because I do have um, access to computers at my job but that's always an option if I need to and I just wanted to show y'all that I'm still carrying the same purse I haven't carried it this entire year um, I've only been carrying it for about the past two weeks, but I've used it a lot. Um, as you can tell, it's starting to look really dingy. Um, and I have, I added this purse charm to it that is really cute. And I still love this bag. Still really love it. Um, I have some casino cards in there. My daily chapstick that I use. I have a vape in this pocket. I have in here my work keys, which I have on a Vera Bradley lanyard, which I really need to desperately clean. And then I also put my house keys in there. <clears throat> Pretty much everything's the same, I want to say, from that last video, except for maybe a couple of things. I have a uh, lotion from Bath & Body Works, hand sanitizer, this is um, papers, I've got a couple of pins, this I got from Dollar Tree and it's actually colored ink so it's purple ink, I've got my Rio pen, quit! She's like over here trying to eat my zipper. Like, no, no. I got this pen, which actually came with my agenda, but I changed it out for the pink version of this. Um, I've got a thing of lip gloss. I've got my vape juice. And I've got my work ID thing right here. You can see. And that's it that's in that pocket. Okay. Um, let's see. I have my wallet. Same pattern. Nothing really changed on that. My checkbook cover. Again, nothing's changed on that. I have some coupons that I need to give to my mom from Kroger have my pill case that I still use from the uh, Midnight Blues. And that's all that's in that main compartment. Now the zipper pocket, pocket. I have some feminine products. I have my oops, my car keys. Super duper cute. Uh, some more feminine products and a little random thing that I need to throw away. So yeah, that's all that's in my purse right now. Um, I'm going to be changing purses here soon. So after I change purses, I'll do another video of what's in my bag. Because I probably will change up a lot of stuff. But anyways, that's it guys. And I just wanted to let y'all know I'm still here. Um, I'm just working hard right now on finishing up my degree. I only have two classes left. I'm in my, um, technically I only have one class left because I'm in that second class right now. So just working on that and trying to get through life as usual, you know, but anyways, y'all have a great day. Thank y'all for watching. Okay. Bye.